He's got a new door, oh. by God. I fell off that roof once. <laughs> <laughs> I did. It's the damnedest thing. Yeah, no. It no. Was, it, was, it wasn't pleasant, though. <laughs> We, we have to campaign everywhere, and that's why we're on this bus tour. We have to make sure uh, that we're hearing people in all corners of the state because we want to govern with every voice in mind. On a trip up here, we were riding in a bus, a school bus, and that's reflective of my background. I'm an educator. But also, for those of you who haven't ridden a school bus in a while, <laughs> guess what? I think we hit every Scott Bowl. <laughs> Been joined with good friends on the bus. We are up at a farm and talking about the importance of rural Wisconsin and, and what Tony is going to do for our schools and our infrastructure and, and broadband connectivity. Tony has dedicated his entire life to our state's children in the classroom as a principal, as our current superintendent of public education. And that's why we're committed to restoring full funding back to our public schools here in the state of Wisconsin. We can do this without raising property taxes. And the good news is, in the past, I would give that budget to Scott Walker, pretty much throw it away. Now I will take that budget and give it to myself and hand it off to these great Democratic legislators behind me. We're going to make sure that people that have pre-existing conditions like me, I'm a cancer survivor. Healthcare is on the ballot, our schools are on the ballot, uh, our environment is on the ballot, because you know, Tony has this weird concept that we should have scientists back in the Department of Natural Resources. <laughs> for change. What I love about Tony is that he has devoted his entire life to make sure that you students have a quality education that is going to do his best on day one to start uniting us again as a state. I'm a pragmatist. I just want to accomplish things. That's the bottom line. And we have so much to gain in this election. You know, Republicans and Democrats want good education. They want a good infrastructure, good roads. They want to have good health care. Who doesn't? So Toma has been part of our lives right from the get-go. We loved Toma. We loved it. And some of the reasons we loved it is because of people like you. No matter what happened, people stood for the right things, whether they were Republicans or Democrats. You made me what I am. Yeah. So I want to thank you. How we will win is with our positive vision to restore hope and opportunity across the state. know how important it is for me at the national level to have partners. Partners at every level of government. An attorney general who's fighting for us and not the big powerful special interests. Boy, we have to elect Josh Call. There is real enthusiasm around the straight the state and it is great to see it. Hello, lacrosse! Are you ready to take our state back? I don't know the last time anybody's been excited about a treasurer's race, but somehow it's Tara got us excited about a treasurer's race. But you know what? While they might have all of this money, we have people power. Please help us out this last few moments. I'm going to ask you to do one more thing. We got we got sheets here for volunteers. We need people to continue to go out, continue to make the calls, continue to go door to door. We're just two young guys traveling. <laughs>